Welcome back, everybody. Hey, friends, oh, loved ones. Hello. Did you miss us? Hello, Reddit DDLC. <laughs> I see you out there. It's a lot better than DDLG. <laughs> what does that stand for? Do you want That's to share? for the viewers to figure out. <laughs> oh, Lord. All right. That's fine. I'll look it up on my phone. I'm going to let everybody else look it up. All right. All right, Natsuki. Or no, wait. This is... All right, narrator. <laughs> Slowly, Natsuki comes to her senses. Gick. She presses her arm straight into me to prop herself up. Eh. Natsuki seems to realize that it's not the floor that's beneath her. It's my... <laughs> oh. I forgot. Gross. Gross. Oh. I forgot that Natsuki is currently on top of us. Yes. <laughs> what a great way to that's start an crazy. episode. easy. Gak. A fist pounds into my chest. Natsuki then hoists herself to her feet. What were you thinking? You sicko. She's so mad. Oh, that's me. Everything okay over there? <laughs> I heard a loud noise! Monica suddenly peers in. Monica. Is it that? See what happens when you put the manga on the top shelf. I just want, like, Are you trying to kill your club members or something? Jeez. Get go man the side! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and one more thing. It seems like your most recent club member is a total pervert. Speaking of which, Charlie just found out what DDLG is. Let me see. Oh, jeez, hold on, let me go I back I forget to what it. it stands for, but it's something about, like, role-playing as, like, a little, little girl. And then your Daddy's boyfriend is your dandy daddy. dandy little girl. It's pretty bad. Oh, boy. Wow, I'm, just, <laughs> I'm gonna leave that. I feel like I can't touch my phone. Can we bleep all of that out? <laughs> yeah, no one ever heard so, that. So, fun yep. story about that, actually. <laughs> um, we were out at a friend's going away party years ago, and one of our friends had a older boyfriend, older uh -huh. gentleman who was her boyfriend, uh -huh. and he insisted that everyone, not just her, but everyone, call him daddy. It's Ew. not enough to just call him dad? No. <laughs> And you gotta so, add the E at the end. And Daddy. so, <laughs> I, I can't remember his name. Maybe it was like Roger or something. I don't, oh, hey, hey. Sounds like a daddy. I was like, so, so Roger, what is it that you do? And he goes, call me daddy. And I go, no, I'm not going to do that, Roger. <laughs> what is it that you do? And he goes, do you feel like paying for the five drinks you've had already? Because they've all been top shelf. And I go, okay, daddy, what do you do? <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe I do like that guy. At first I was like, no. But then I realized that he's manipulating people with alcohol. Well, yeah, he, he paid for everybody's drinks that night. Yeah, so. as long as they all called him daddy. I like that. That's still uncomfortable, but hilarious. So I hope you're happy. I didn't... Somehow, it's impossible for me to explain this whole bizarre situation to Monica. I didn't do anything, I swear. Look at her stupid smile. I know, I know, don't worry. Monica says that quietly to me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Although I'm pretty sure Monica is incapable of being quiet. <laughs> that was my quiet voice. <laughs> <laughs> you want to hear my loud voice? <laughs> <laughs> What's that, Mom? The test results came in? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I'm off the hook. Oh, no. You're not off the hook. Girl. My. My. Eh? Huh? I look down. Natsuki is kneeling on the floor, holding one of the books that are scattered all over. Oh, she's going to get triggered so bad. There's a large diagonal crease along the page that she's desperately trying to smooth oh, out. Oh, no, Wes, put some, like, horror music in the background, please. <laughs> like wait, that. wait, wait! <laughs> uh, it must have landed on the page. Natsuki tries to, a bit more to fix the crease, but she can't get it out. <laughs> We've all been there, baby girl. It's not coming out. Suddenly, she gives up and slams the book shut, then throws it to the floor. Yeah, let's just damage the book more. <laughs> Look at the true toddler you are. <laughs> Instead of continuing to yell, she just lowers her head. <coughs> <laughs> Such a manly, manly sob. <laughs> Natsuki, are you... No. Natsuki's voice squeaks. I see tears on her face. Ah. Uh, I'll help get the crease out, okay? Actually, you know what he needs to do? He needs what? to walk himself over to Barnes & Noble and just buy a new copy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. If he wants to actually be a good guy, because you know you're not getting that crease out. Continue. I'm sorry, I'm bitter. It's partially <laughs> my fault, so... Natsuki shakes her head, still looking down. No. I don't even care that much. I'm just... having a really bad day today. Natsuki sobs again. I didn't mean to take it out on you. 
I really didn't mean to. It's fine. Is there anything you want to talk about? Natsuki shakes her head. Just every day is so hard. <laughs> oh my god. I just want to come to the club and kill myself. Uh. <laughs> Natsuki falls silent again. I can't press her, so I can only do what I know how to do. All right. Well, I'll help clean this up. And I'll move the rest of your manga for you. Ah. I pick up volume two of Parfait Girls. We'll set this one aside. This'll help cheer you up a bit, right? We can get started on it once I'm done here. Natsuki looks up with her glossy eyes. <laughs> Doesn't it look like she's smirking a little bit? She's a smug bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I like her. <laughs> smug anime girl. Her lip quivers. With anticipation. <laughs> <laughs> you're... You're really nice to me. Eh? He's not that nice. We know what he's <laughs> That sounds really strange coming from Natsuki. I didn't expect it at all. Well... I'm just treating you like a friend, you know? Mm. Natsuki lowers her head and stifles another sob. <laughs> and I'm not <laughs> I'm not sure yes. what happened to her today, but being nice is the least I could do. Or every day, because every day is so hard. <laughs> the next couple minutes are silent between us as I begin gathering the scattered books. <laughs> I make sure to slip them into the box in their what? correct order. After a little bit, Natsuki starts helping. About time. It isn't long before we're done, and I hoist the box onto the shelf where Natsuki wanted to put it. Then, I get on the stool and quickly finish moving the rest of her books from the top shelf. All right. That should do it. I hop off the stool. Natsuki averts her gaze. <laughs> yes? Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Thanks. <laughs> it's nothing. Natsuki is holding the volume I set aside in her hands. All right, I'm ready. Good. Even if you weren't, I'd make you anyway. You're taking responsibility for what you said. The thing about cheering me up. If you insist. Like, it's, it's, I don't know if this is even weird or just stupid. Like, only Monica came over and helped. Did Yuri and Sarah... Monica didn't do shit. Okay, well, yeah, not help, but, like, She just notice. came over and she was like, Hey, did something happen here? <laughs> yeah, but the other... Where are the other two still in the room? Like, uh, somewhere, what? maybe. How did they not hear that? It's a big room. They're all pooping. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they went to the powder room, Charlie. Yeah. Powder room. Take a big deuce. Girls don't poop. <laughs> they don't. They... <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Graz calls it honking out a dirt snake. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, shout out to Dr. Oz. Let's just put him up in the corner for like a little bit. Dr. Oz is going to sue us for copyright. Do it. <laughs> I'd love that. I'd love to see him in court. We sit in the same spot as last time, and I hope in the second volume. Natsuki's mood quickly improves, laughing and pointing things out to me. She's surprisingly sharp, making note of a lot of subtle, repeated jokes and background elements. In the end, I'm pretty impressed by how everything ties together in this manga. I guess Natsuki has good taste after all. After some time, Monica gets our attention as usual, and it's time to share oh, poems here we again. Go. Oh boy, everybody, I can't wait! Guess I'll be holding on to this for now. Yep. Even you sound more enthusiastic this time. Well, I'm starting to get into it, you know? <laughs> Told you. That weird toothy grin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's got that tsundere fang. <laughs> I return to my seat and slip the book into my bag. Okay, guys, who should I show my poem to first? Does it, does it affect how much they like you? Yeah, what's the trick? Nah, uh, we shouldn't ask him. He knows. Yeah, you know too much. Selena, call it. You call it, you go. Uh... Monica, hers are always the most impressive. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Hashtag holes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot she wrote the whole poem. <laughs> Take it away. Oh, yeah. Hi again, TCC. How's the writing going? All right, I guess. I'll take that. As long as it's not going bad. 
I'm happy that you're applying yourself. Maybe soon you'll come up with a masterpiece. Or something competent. <laughs> That's what she's actually thinking. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't count on that. You never know. She says that a lot. <laughs> Wanna share what you wrote for today? Sure, here you go. I give my poem to Monica. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's pretty good. You've been spending some time with Natsuki, haven't you? Must be all about parfait girls. You must like her writing style. <laughs> I think she's dissing her because Nazi's poems are crap. It's just a book report on parfait girls, volume one. <laughs> <laughs> There's absolutely no meter or any of that to it. It's literally just free form. Free form. <laughs> it's even in, like just judgment orient orientation. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I think it's a neat way to tell a story. Mm hmm. I don't disagree. <laughs> but I don't agree. <laughs> <laughs> what, does that, what does that even mean? <laughs> Natsuki's poems may be cute, but they're also meaningful. I can see why you would be into the style. I guess that means you're not as much a fan of Yuri's poems then. Nope. Oh, uh, saucy. I wouldn't right say points. that. I kind of like everyone's poems. Oh yeah, do ya? Do, do they all get trophies too? Piece of crap. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, we're raising a snowflake generation in this <laughs> they game. They can all be my trophy wives. <laughs> oh yeah, I hope they fight over me. <laughs> That's true. But I'm sure you like some more than others, right? Like Yuri's use of complex words and symbolism. Or Sayori's way of expressing happiness or sadness in a more direct way. I think Monica likes the divisionism a little bit too much. I knew she was Donald Trump. <laughs> oh Everybody don't take what I say to heart. <laughs> Hot take. Hot take. I fall in the middle with politics. My <laughs> poems are very good. They're the best poems. <laughs> All the other poems are like Swiss cheese. They're full of holes. <laughs> holes. They're full of holes. <laughs> I get it now. That's why she threw my holes. I think we already mentioned this before. <laughs> Well, I'm having deja vu. I can't remember anything that happened a week ago. So. Oh my god. We're gonna have the best poems out there. They're gonna be so much better than giant Frankly. Poems. He says frankly a lot. It really <laughs> just it warms my heart. You yeah. must have some kind of preference, don't you? Ah, uh, not that it's a contest or anything. I was just curious, that's all. You like to meddle, Monica. But anyway... You want to read my poem now? Yes, 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 yes. yes. Uh, I like this way. The way this one turned out, <laughs> so I hope you do too. <laughs> oh, All right, let's take a look. I'm really alarmed by the thing she's writing. <laughs> <laughs> I th I'm really starting to think she's the crazy one. Somebody said She's the Gondari! I'm calling it. Take it away, boot dude. <laughs> save me. The colors, they won't stop. Bright, beautiful colors. Flashing, exploding, piercing. It's red, expanding. green, blue. An endless cacophony of meaningless noise. The noise, it won't stop. Violent... Grating waveforms, squeaking, screeching, piercing, sine, cosine, tangent, <laughs> like a playing, like playing a chalkboard on a turntable, like playing a vinyl on a pizza crust. An endless poem of meaningless. What? Load me. Oh, that's. Something's going on. I think this game's starting to get a little meta, and that's my guess. She's saying, load me. Is she like Giffany from she, Gravity Falls? She also says, save me. But load me? I think she knows she's in a video game. Load me up with your baby batter. Oh, your baby batter. Yeah, go, go for the good to use easy ones. <laughs> that's, that's, that was low-hanging fruit, I admit. Oh, you made me ink. <laughs> This is a little. This is a weird poem. <laughs> see, what if that's how she ended it? Ah, you made me ache. <laughs> you can see the thing that was like the way Selena portrays her voice it makes me feel like she's dumb as bricks. So if she gets meta, it's gonna be really, really. Something's dumb. going. I just everything up to this point has told me I shouldn't trust her. Yeah. I, don't, I don't. I think there's maybe like one of the characters I'm not supposed to trust, but I'm not sure. Guys, 
Come back next time. We're gonna uh, go on to the next poems. We're gonna keep yeah. unfolding this mystery. Yeah. Tim, you got anything to say? Leave us out. Uh, come back. Bye. Gotcha.